What's up YouTube and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke, episode 20! We have hit the big 2-0 on Pokemon Crystal which is super hype. In the last episode, which was yesterday, there was total chaos from start to finish. I don't want to spoil too much, especially before you have the chance to click away, but if you haven't seen the last episode, like, we added a party member and then subtracted three party members. Like, that's all I'm going to say. It, it was absolutely insane. So if you missed the last episode and you don't want to be spoiled, you only have about 10 or 15 seconds until, you know, you need to be clicking on the, clicking on the card that's right above my face and go check out that last episode. <clears throat> In today's episode, uh, we're going to attempt to rebuild what was lost in the last episode. So there's two cities that we're going to fly to to try and catch an encounter, I think, I think. Um, and then we're going to head uh, east of Ecrutique City um, and continue on with the game. So if you're excited for the last episode of Pokemon Crystal this week, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, and if you enjoy, share the video around with a friend. Let's see if we can grow this series even more. Now, this is where you need to be clicked away because spoilers happen right here. So let's do a team recap. Let's not do a team recap. Oh my god. I, I ended the episode right there and I didn't move afterwards. I didn't do anything afterwards. I raged out. Because we got destroyed. Ah. <sighs> Oh my goodness. Okay, so we have to deposit. Rajiv was the first to go down. He's holding something. He's holding the Quick Claw. Okay. <clears throat> now, Rajiv was the first to go down. He went down to a crit lick from a freaking Voltorb. I love Rajiv. Clovis went down to, I believe he also went down to a crit, I think he went down to a crit Aurora Beam from the freaking Aerodactyl. And also, meeting the same fate, was Haynes the Arcanine. Oh my goodness. Now let's change back to box one. Wait, how many Pokemon are there in box 14? We've lost 18 Pokemon! We're about to have to start a new box that's that's crazy now we do have pokemon that we could add but uh i i, I don't want to do that i don't want to do that i don't do that oh my god leave me alone every time i turn the game on she calls every time okay um so let's go ahead and do a team recap let's uh let's move you here all right uh i guess the best way to do it would be to go like this first up is the person that saved us in the last episode, and that's Sarah, the Grass Poison type Dragonite, with Strength Rolling Kick, Dizzy Punch, Octazuka, holding the Amulet Coin, with good stats overall. Next up, we have, I should have put more faith in Sophronia. I forgot that she has Sleep Powder, but she's a Ghost type Ponyta, with High Jump Kick, Sleep Powder, Triple Kick, and Fly. If I would have switched this in on that, Ar that Aerodactyl, I could have saved at least two of our friends. Low stats. And next up is the Pokemon that we caught last episode. And that's Uriel the Mew. Our, our, our ice normal type Mew. With Flamethrower Cut, Fire Blast, and Hyper Fang. And pretty good stats. That, st that speed stat is insane. Our attack and special attack aren't too high, but and our special attacks or our special defense is pretty low. That's what we have. So that's um that's not good. All right, let's go ahead and run up in this mart. Now, if you remember, at the end of the episode, <clears throat> uh, little Jasmine gave us recover. Stupid. I'm so mad that she actually gave us recover. Like, <laughs> that's such an insult. All right, I don't wanna spend that much. Do I need hyper potions? I don't think I need hyper potions yet. I already have, I have seven hyper potions. 13 super potions. Uh, let's just go with like seven more of these. I guess I can get three more of these. And I have 
21, so let's buy like nine of these. Because you never know what I'm going to run into. Alright, and that, that leaves us some money. So, I do have fly still. Right? Right here. Yes, okay, good. So let's fly to... <clears throat> let's start by flying back to Ecritique. I don't have Surf anymore, so I'm going to Rod. Surf has been pretty good for us though. Do, can any of these guys learn Surf? Sarah can learn Surf. I don't really use Octazooka, I pretty much just use Rolling Kick. Um, Let's not, let's not, let's just, uh... Okay, so instead we're gonna come to our good rod. Where's our good rod? There's our good rod. All right, first encounter is a Kingler. Okay. <clears throat> so let's go with... Actually, you'll kill it. So let's switch off to Sophronia. Oh God. I'm gonna go with triple kick. It doesn't affect, so it's a ground type. Good to know. Please don't kill anybody else on our team. Oh my goodness. So it's a ground type, so high jump kick won't be very effective. Good. Good logic there. Transformed into a rock type. So again, high jump kick won't be very effective. Okay, good. Oh, that's too much damage. Also, I should have just put it back to sleep. I don't know why I didn't do that. Uh, but let's go ahead and throw this great ball and catch it. Again, our team got destroyed, man. We had three good members fall. All right, stay in the ball. 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 Oh my gosh. It is shaken three times like every time! Thank you! Jeez! No need for that. Alright, this is a male. We already have our gener name generator pulled up. We have Kingler, the pincer Pokemon. It's oversized claw is very powerful, but when it's not in battle, the claw just gets in the way. Okay. Give Kingler a nickname. His nickname will be... I wish this website like showed me what the name was from. Like, I could look it up. I could go back and look it up. But, uh... We have Hohipa! The Kingler. Alright, let's go and run over here. Now, I, I, was, I was just thinking about this as we were in that encounter. Um, you know, I have these Evolve Pokemon that I haven't really used. But, like... Butterfree, Dark Water type, Razor Wind, Ice Beam Pound. Wait, can I just, uh... Okay, good. Uh, now, what I should do is I should look through this off camera, but Ghost type, Macargo, Earthquake, Dragon Breath. Pretty decent stats. We need a Leaf Stone or a Sunstone here, but Icy Wind, Mach Punch, Fury Attack, and Dizzy Punch. That could actually be pretty good. Might have to check and see what's going on with this Gloom. Zipora, I really don't want to use a Ditto. We've already used the Muck. So this is our newest one. So we have uh, Hohipa, the flying ground type. That's actually pretty broken. That's cool. With Tackle, actually those are like polar opposites. That's weird. Uh, tackle, Cross Chop, Earthquake, and Conversion 2. That's actually really good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and withdraw Hohipa. All right, uh, so now the next area that we should go is back to Goldenrod City. <clears throat> but I was just thinking about this. We can't exactly do what I expected to do. So what we're gonna do is, oh wait, I don't have Surf yet. Can Hohipa learn Surf? Good, Hohipa. Get rid of that conversion too. All right, great. Ooh, we found a focus band, okay. 
Now these trainers, if I remember correctly, I think they're pretty strong. Sarah's out front first, so, so we'll be okay. We're gonna jump right in the middle of all three of them. Hopefully we don't lose to them. That could be tragic, but uh, but yeah, I think today we're just gonna do our encounters and see where we get in, um, what level? 24, okay. So I could even potentially use Hohipa here. Um, we'll see what happens. Okay, Sarah, you gotta calm down with that. Um, I was just fighting against these things. And I don't exactly remember. I used to have one too. What was its typing? Also, I have two ghost type attacks. Um, which one does more? Also, I realized that um, Dragon Rage does a fixed 30 damage. So when I was struggling with what to use against that Mew, or against our Mew from yesterday, I should have just used that. Uh, so you can't just beat Irene and go unpunished? Okay, I see you. Hey, I'm, I'm just trying to get a little training in. I didn't do anything to anybody. <clears throat> we might just let Sarah go ahead and take this. Oh, crap. I'm terrified of getting hit by something and dying and just like exploding off the screen. Magmar's faster than me, that's crazy. Lapras. I would love to have a Lapras. Where's my Lapras? Rolling Kick is so broken. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Alright, actually here's what we're gonna do. Let's go ahead and give... let's give Uriel our first battle. Persian, okay. All right, Uriel, flamethrower. Okay, it's not very effective. Don't kill me. Okay. Cut. Right. Hyperfin. All right, I think we can take this thing out just by chopping at it. Yeah. All right, cool. Cubone. Let's go ahead and heal. I'm not super worried about a Cubone. But as soon as I say that, it's going to use something and just absolutely wreck me. Okay, flamethrower's good. Cut's not good. We got to find some good moves for our Mew. All right, Mew's first victory. All right, and that takes care of this little sec- this little, uh, thing. Isn't there a hidden item around here somewhere? Hold on. Hold on. Isn't there a hidden item here somewhere? Wait. Go back. I don't have an item finder. I'm pretty sure there is a hidden item somewhere, but I don't remember where it is. So, uh, let's jump on our Ponyta, who's I guess like a, actually like a unicorn using fly. All right, so this is the team of four that we're gonna rock with. Let's run over here. Now we have two encounters that we can do right now, like right this second. First, we're gonna run in here. I'm trying to decide if I should do Mount Mortar. I could, um, I could, I could, I think I might explore this whole cave. A Murkrow! I mean, it's not the most exciting thing I've ever seen, but it's not bad. Switching to Sophronia first. <laughs> you got it. You got it, Murkrow. That Murkrow did not want to be on our team. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. Let me go ahead and switch to Sophronia. And then let's find our, uh, this is route, whatever it said. I think it said 42. It's an Abra. Ooh. That's good because Abra evolves the very next level. Okay, Abra, you're asleep. Now. I'm just gonna kind of th I'm just gonna throw a couple of these and see how it works out for us. Okay, I feel confident just kind of throwing the balls. I could switch out to our uh, Ohipa. There we go. Okay, I didn't think I needed to. Let's just generate another name. Got ourselves Abra the Psy Pokemon. It hypnotizes itself so they can teleport away when it senses danger, even if it's asleep. That's not what I just saw. 
All right, we are gonna give it a nickname. Here's a pretty cool nickname. His name is... Jawdat. All right, and he's getting immediately added to the team because he can evolve. All right, let's run back and heal first and then we'll check out our Abra. And then we got a little, we got a few minutes left, so let's go ahead and see if we can make it all the way to uh, wherever we're going. Oh, right. So, this is what the squad is looking like now. So let's take a look at... Oh, he has Headbutt! Well, I could have used Headbutt in this route, but now I could go back to Azalea. In fact, I might just do that. Because um, I don't think I got an encounter in Azalea Town. Uh, but we're, we are jawed at the Rock-type Abra. With agility, ice punch, reversal, and headbutt. It's actually not bad. And well-balanced stats. Okay. Since we're still at a team of five, how about we go ahead, jump on Sophronia again. Now that we have headbutt. I think we might as well. Let's run it back to Azalea Town. Okay. Uh, and we're just going to headbutt some stuff. So, where's a good tree? Where's a good tree? Here's a good tree. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? A Dawn fan! That's that's pretty cool! Now, again, we can't hit this thing. But we can put it to sleep and throw balls at it. And if it's good, we'll add it to the team. We will have to do a grinding montage. Uh, well, that's that. Another male! Dawn fan, the armor Pokemon! Because this Pokemon skin is so tough, a normal attack won't even leave a scratch on it! You're right, I didn't hit it at all. Ooh, ooh, this name! Ooh! Because of this name, I might have to add it. We have Goliath, the Dawn fan! Let's check out Goliath, our Dawn fan. The electric type Pokemon with Rage, Sludge Bomb, Shadow Ball, and Counter. Carrying a Park Ball. Give me that Park Ball. That's pretty hype. That is pretty hype. Okay, so we could do the. Um, nah. I was thinking that we could do the um, uh, Union Cave, like the second half of the Union Cave. Uh, the basement and all that stuff. Um, but I think that might take a little... That, 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 I don't know if there's any reason to do that. I guess there's items, and we used our Master Ball last episode, so... Alright! Should I do it? Should I do it now? Wait, is this where I catch Suicune? <clears throat> Alright, let me go ahead and save... We are going to let uh, Sophronia lead us. Nope, that's not where I catch Suicune. He's gone. He just said I'm out. Okay. Apparently I don't remember where that happens. A uh, Twisted Spoon. Or an Abra, that might be good. Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I caught. Bring it on! I have a Sophronia! Just smack you up! Smack, 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 smack! Well, actually, it's gonna put you to sleep and then kick you, but... Oh my god... Too soon, game! Too soon! You wanna see what I do to, to Aerodactyls? This is what I do to Aerodactyls. And Sophronia doesn't miss! Sophronia is a flying... Ponyta. He flies. We use high jump kick. It should be called fly jump kick. What you got to say now? I want to know. I want to become the trainer champ using the Pokemon I caught. That's the best part of fishing. Hey, you're trying to be the ultimate trainer too. Then we're comrades. If, if I find any more items by the water, I'll give you some. Just give me your phone number. Nah. I'll just have them to myself. Hey. You got it, bro. T take him. All right, here we go. What did he say? He said, this place is ours. Get lost. Or something like that. 
boom, 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 boom. We're going to make it to this city up here, and then we'll be done for the day, for the week. Oh, my gosh. Weeks are going by so fast. Sophronia doesn't miss. I mean, High Jump Kick obviously has, you know, all these moves have different, uh, different properties. That was the word I was looking for. Why are they so weak? I'll never understand this. Like, I get it. Because this area opened as soon as... I don't need to do anything. This area opened as soon as you got cut. Or as soon as you got surf. Um, so that's why they're so weak. But my goodness. Like, I just destroyed these people. Okay, so that's the same. We did not get a new, a new route. Okay, so we have two options for the next episode. In the next episode, either we could go up this way, or we could do Union Cave, uh, the like the underground part of it, uh, as well as Mount Mortar. I'm kind of leaning towards that. Again, I'm not really in any rush. Uh, it was just kind of be a chill episode, just traveling through, get battling trainers and all that stuff. I'm not totally sure. So let me know what you think in the comments below, as well as answer whatever question of the day I come up with, which is below me. Uh, answer that in the comments below so we can talk. I would love to talk to people in the comments. Uh, all you gotta do is answer the question of the day. But that is going to do it for today's episode of Pokemon Crystal. Uh, today we did a rebuilding episode, which I think we did a pretty decent job at. Adding three members to our team that we're going to train up uh, in the next episode. Hohipa, the Kingler, Jondat, the Abra, and Goliath, the Dawn fan. We're train up all of them. And the, before the next episode, actually, we might do a grinding montage at the end of this episode. I'm not totally sure. We'll see what happens. Uh, but if you enjoyed today's episode, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And share this video with a friend that you think might enjoy it. Help me to build this, uh, this Let's Play even bigger than it is now. We will see you on Monday with more Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke. Until then, have a blessed day.